cool. Um, okay, right, where do I start? Because uh, it's been a bit of a, an evening. Okay, let's start with, uh, obviously, your performance. Great performance. Um, I missed the first two rounds. Um, so, yeah, do you want to talk me from... Yeah, the top. first couple rounds, first round one, two, one and two, I was, I just wanted to establish my jab because I knew he was kind of slick and I was coming into it, I'm gonna, kind of, I'm not like a big brawler but I'm mm. gonna come forward centre, so like I knew I didn't want to come in trying to swing wide because he would counter me all day, so I was like you know what, I'm gonna do basics, set up the jab and if I set up my jab everything else will come, yeah. and I know I've got I'm not like a good one. Um, yeah, just, just picking that set up. Um, yeah, we're saying about, yeah, yeah. Talk about the game plan going into the fight. There wasn't really a game plan, it was just for me to focus on not swinging wild and getting too <coughs> emotionally like, heated. Yeah. So I just wanted to establish the jab and um, establish my fundamentals and not go wild trying to swing. Mm. I knew he was slick, but I knew. I knew he was slick, but I knew he wasn't like the, he was slick, but he's not like defensively mm. sound. He relies on athleticness. Yeah. So I was like, I'll just use my jab, catch with the jab, because I know you ain't, you can't jab there. Mm. And then I'll set up from there. Everything came up from there. And then um, I, it was basically me just taking away his fitness, yeah. athleticism, yeah. and then me. Yeah, because yeah, you caught him a few times and obviously his face started yeah, dying, yeah. his eyes was like really I have swelling. To I'm heavy handed but I know that but I'm not explosive, that's what I'm talking about. When I hit people, they shell up and then they move and I'm, and I'm, still, I'm still learning yeah. until I put a punch to them. So every time I hurt him, I was like, I know that was hard. You, you look like you're like really, like you're smiling, you're yeah. talking to him throughout the yeah. ring. I mean, obviously there's a lot of kind of beef, um, which for people that don't know, it's kind of kicked off a little bit um, outside. But I mean, it's, it looked like you... <laughs> <laughs> you kind of like uh, had um, a game plan, which was to you know to end it kind of early. Um, I didn't. I didn't think about ending it. I just wanted. To, I wanted to win. I wanted to. I wanted to win the boxing early. Yeah. And I think it was even, but. Mm. I could, but I, as the rounds go on, I've got yeah. a good engine, he hasn't. Yeah, that, that was the thing, so your engine looked like it was coming to play, you looked yeah. like, you know, you, you didn't look like you were flagging or whatever, so obviously testament to yourself for, for good fitness and what have you. Um, but obviously, um, I won't do a long one because of uh, some events tonight, but I mean, um, did you want to chat out like your social medias and and sponsors and thank anyone that's... Uh... Um, yeah. You know, sponsors, you'd be, you be missing something. Go on, let me put... Um, I'd like to... Give my Instagram handle Black Panther Boxing. Did you come to uh, my Twitter Luther Clay ninety five, and that's that's my social media. Yep. And then my sponsors, um, they're, they're like a bunch of local um, businesses to Bracknell. Up. Yeah, I'll just I'll name them out. Oh, um, you've got Tecton Contractors, a building and roof in my Twitter. Then you've got PSI Personal. Uh, so he's it's, it's my, it's my, it's my yeah. personal trainer. Yeah. Then you got uh, Canisaw UK. Then you got um, Bracknell Football Club and the SB Club. That's the same thing. Plum World Roots. That's my meal prep. Um, Owls Family Butchers. That's the butcher that gives yeah. me like three minutes. So, Fighting Fit. Give me all my equipment. Um, Uni Group. That's a uh, home building. Yeah. And they help me out financially. And admin. Yeah. That's uh, my local pub where I'm always down. And they help me out as well. Mm. I try to thank everyone in Bracknell that helps me. All the business support me. I'm not a big name. I'm getting better. And I'm, I'm trying to make you proud. And last thing, I'd like to say sorry about tonight. Um, I completely, I completely just messed up. And, um, there's a riot because of my um, mouth at the end and I want to say I'm sorry um, to Shane's team I'm sorry for my behaviour um, to Shane I'm sorry and um, if anyone got hurt tonight my, my apologies I didn't mean to do that I got heated and um, I'm sorry and uh, to the Bratton Leisure Centre I'm really sorry uh, I didn't expect anything like that to happen I was just chatting I had a lot of fire in me for a long time and it just came out that's never happened before in the fight and it'll never happen again and I'm just really sorry thanks, well, thanks for giving us your time I know it's been quite a bit of an emotional kind of time and, and uh, yeah thanks hopefully we'll see you out soon cheers mate thank you